hi guys welcome back to my channel it has been so long since i've seen you last and oh how i've missed you guys so much um really quick i got back from vacation and just been laying low i haven't been doing much i did a couple shorts i think but that's it um but i'm on today because i have to get ready to go to the store and i'm doing a um unboxing for my base box for a boxy charm so let's get into this because i gotta be quick today um one of the I, I had to open this in the car the other day and i gave my mom and dad one of the items so i'll let you know what that was here is the theme or whatever it says go all out i guess it's like travel i guess so the first item up let's get everything out so we can get this box out of the way so guys how's it been going like anybody still doing the weight loss challenge or i haven't talked to anyone what's going on guys anything new what's up what's up um i hope everyone's doing good Oh, I look crazy. My eyes are still swollen. I just took a shower. I'm like extremely tired, but gotta keep moving, right? Okay, first things first, Kate Somerville Exfoliate um, Glow Moisturizer, which I guess is this. Yes. Yeah, so this is what it looks like. This is going for $70. I think that's a bit steep, but you know how their prices are. They're crazy. Revive Dull Dry Lackluster Looking Skin with Kate's Exfoliate. Um, it's called Ex Exfoliate Kate kind of stupid but whatever glow moisturizer powerhouse ingredients moves dead removes dead skin wrinkles blah blah, blah. i can't use this right now because i already put foundation on but for 70 dollars, let's look at the container hopefully it's made out of gold no okay that's what it looks like let's open it and see how it smells at least hmm okay it smells good <laughs> it does kind of like orange i guess i don't know i can't tell it smells clean so this is I'll use this tonight. Pure Lease Ageless Glow Serum BB Cream, which I could have used this today, but again, I already have my foundation on. Uh, Pure Lease Ange Ageless Glow Serum BB Cream is going for $38, which their prices are usually about that much. Anyway, that's what it looks like. Nothing special with that. We've seen it all. Ditto Cosmetics Limited Edition Venus Palette. Now this I can use today and right now. This is what this looks like. This is going for $29.99. It has a sticker here. Okay, let's see what this looks like. I don't like how they put that sticker there, actually. See how now it's, like, all sticky and stuff? Kind of, like, ruined the palette. <sighs> oh, it's nice. This is going for $29.99. You have Earth, Mercury, Mars. Um, ooh, I, I like this one. I can't even say that. Uh, Demos. Um, Venus. Um, okay, I, I don't know. Different different words I don't know. Callisto, I.O., Europe. Europa. Okay. Next and last but not least is going to be the um, Mana Kadar Beauty Hydration Happy Face Mist. This is going for $19. I mean, we can spritz a little on, I'm sure, even if we have makeup on. I just want to smell it. Let's see. Oh, yeah. It smells really good. Really good. It smells clean. So, nice. The AMNH Skincare Starry Collagen Gel Eye Pads for $32. They were just um, gel eye pads. I believe five came in a box. I did give them to my dad. He doesn't sleep well. And I wanted to make sure he had something for under his eyes when he doesn't sleep. So, that's it, guys. Let's fucking get started. I gotta go. My mom's waiting. I got up pretty late. Um, I've been watching The Sopranos like every day because uh, I'm going to use Moon. Okay, guys, I'm not sure what I'm wearing today. So let's just, you know, pick a neutral color um, because there's going to be a new movie coming out, guys. If you're a Sopranos fan, I believe it's in October. And what it basically is, is it's when so uh, Tony Soprano was young. Um, in Newark, um, and his actual son in real life will be playing him for James Galdafini, if I'm saying that correctly, I, Galdafini, um, will be playing his actual role, so that's pretty cool. He actually passed away in Italy with a heart attack, which was very sad. Um, Sopranos is one of my favorite series ever. Um, and I watched it, of course, when it first came out, which was years ago. I, I, God, I don't even remember when. Alexa, when did The Sopranos come out?
January 10th, 1999. My other Alexa's is talking too. So I have one here, one over there. I have like six Alexas. Okay, so next we're gonna go in with something easy. I'm gonna do this number. It's, it looks like a number 10, basically. I think it says IO is what that really is supposed to say, but let's just do that bottom here. This palette's nice, guys. I hope everybody who gets boxy um, for this month gets this. I'm not sure if it was uh, just, you know, certain people that got this or was that a, a palette in everybody's box? It's really smooth. <laughs> but how's everyone doing otherwise? I'm going to be going to the store to Walmart. I'm not sure, like, what all I'm buying because uh, I'm just supposed to be going there to get, like, a card for my... My friend's having a 10-year anniversary party tomorrow, and I'm going to be getting um, dressed up, doing my hair, blase, blah, blah, so um, I got to go get her a card and, like, a gift card. Now, I have a dress, which I'll insert, of what I was going to wear, but then I reordered another dress because I just wasn't feeling that one. The sleeves were beyond annoying. Like, I just don't want to have an annoying night with annoying sleeves. So, my other dress comes today by 10 o'clock. So, it's going to be a surprise whether I get to switch dresses or not. I have no idea. I mean, hopefully I do. guess we'll find out. I'm going to go ahead and just clean my brush real quick. This is called Black Slate. It's a, bl a brush cleaning pad. So, you can get these for like $3, $4. Um, basically, it's, it almost looks like a, a, br a scrubber you'd use in the in the shower in the shower i'm sorry i'm so tired a scrubber you would use in the at the sink a brillo pad okay scrub that off and it cleans your brush enough to alternate colors so i'm gonna go in with venus for the inner corner guys we're just making this quick because i gotta go okay guys i just did a quick highlight right there and i'm actually gonna go ahead in with i mean we're just going to walmart so most people wear pajamas there i don't think i really have to worry <sighs> and i'm just gonna put some of that there too it wasn't really popping like i thought it would be so so far this palette this color here was not highly pigmented i'm not sure if i needed to add a little bit more i don't think so i just i mean i, I felt like i put enough but you don't got that pop, you know what I mean? You can see the difference, see how much that popped and that didn't. So uh, it's an all white party, which I'm thinking, why don't you just tell people to come naked? Because like all white, literally, you see every freaking little groove in your body. It's horrible, you know? All my friends were like, what the fuck? We gotta wear white? All right, I guess, <laughs> you know? So, you gotta wear white, so that's why I don't have, I mean, I have, like, two white dresses that I already had, and then I had bought the one that I'm gonna show you, that I had showed you, and then, um, I just bought that, the other one I just showed you. So, we'll see how this goes. Okay, guys, so, all in all, Ditto Venus Palette Limited Edition is a good one. I think it's really pretty. I like the way it came out. Very light, not too crazy. Go in here and get my eyebrows going so I can get moving. Alexa, what time is it? The time is 11.29 a.m. Yeah, I, I want to be out the door by 12. I'm um, thinking what else have I been doing? Absolutely nothing, to be honest. Uh, my nephews were supposed to come up, but my, nep uh, but my one nephew ended up not feeling well. Um, he had pink eye and stuff. I think from the pool, probably, because, you know, you're around other little kids that touch everything. Because they don't really go anywhere. They're not in school yet, so. But he's fine. Um, hopefully, you know, hopefully everything goes well and he's okay. But I wanted to see them, so we'll have to reschedule that. But that was supposed to be this week. So that's going to be rescheduled, hopefully. And we can see him, well, them. Okay, guys, so I'm just going to go ahead and... and just go with the rest of my own makeup. This is actually a really good, um, it's, it's Alomar. This is a really good blush. Okay, be careful if you use this one, which you can see I use it a lot. However, don't be heavy handed with it because it comes out very dark. Like it's very pigmented this. You see how, 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 how dark that is. So be careful. My Coco Couture Too Faced. Guys, tomorrow I'll probably do a get ready with me. When I do these little get readies, they're just they're just stupid get ready he's like just going to the store but tomorrow i actually have to get ready to go somewhere so i'm gonna be putting on um like somewhere special so i'm gonna be 
doing my makeup obviously a little bit more serious um, this is just um, just so I can leave my house and not look crazy basically okay so I think we're done with all that um, let's do a little oh crap I haven't had this on the whole time fucking great Listen, if you have not bought this yet, please go buy Essence Lash Princess, okay? They have, I think, four different ones. I have three of the four, I believe. Um, this came out so long ago. Guys, there is no need to buy, like, expensive um, mascara when this mascara is probably, I think, like, $4.99. You can buy it from Walmart. You can get it from um, Ulta. This is the best mascara. I'm sorry. It's probably my favorite, and it's so cheap. Most of the time, those, um, sorry, I'm dropping my stuff here. Most of the time, expensive stuff is not even worth the money. Let's keep it 100 here. Watch this. This one is to make it look like you're wearing lashes. This one is called um, False Lash Effect. I mean, my lashes are um, already quite thick. I'm mean, not thick, long. They have foundation on them right now, but you know. I mean, even with somebody with shorter lashes, you're still gonna get a nice effect with these um, mascaras. And like I said, they're like five dollars. So here, take a look. Does anyone else do this? When I get ready, I take my foundation brush and wipe it across my whole face, like across my whole mouth. So if you're seeing, oh. so if you're seeing my mouth look like, see, it looks like I almost don't even have a lip there. That's why um, it's because I do that. Guys, I feel like I'm forgetting something I'm trying to think. Okay, let's use the Jeffree Star highlights. I don't know what I'm wearing, like I said, so I don't know what I'm doing here. Let's look at this one. Okay, yeah, we'll go with this. This is the Skin Frost Peach Goddess, only because I already have, like, the peachy looking. They have, guys, they have a sale for Cab Cosmetics, 40% off. If anyone's looking to get, you know, some really nice lip kits. She has a bunch of stuff like right here is her oil her lip oil stuff like that um but i would recommend getting it if you are a lip kit fan <laughs> if, if you've seen um previous videos you know what i'm talking about as far as the lip kit it comes with a lip gloss a lipstick and a lip liner the lip liner is fucking drying so i wouldn't recommend even using it i mean maybe you can work it out a little bit but i've not liked any of the lip liners i just use my own lip liners so I'll just use my own with her lipstick and lip gloss because I and it comes with a little sharpener but I can say it is well worth it okay I can say that so I'm gonna go ahead and use my watermelon revolution dewy makeup setting spray oh, I feel so good because I'm so tired because I have to do my hair and like get get moving but let's put on some um some lip color here what do I want to put on? I mean, we'll, I'll just put on some lip oil for now until I... This is the Cab Cosmetics. This is her lip oil. This one is Rum Punch. That's what it looks like. All right, I'll be back, guys. I'm going to do my hair quickly. Um, you've seen all the BoxyCharm stuff. Um, it was well worth the box, I think, because this palette alone was bomb. So I'll be right back. I figure since I'm on and I'm going to have to do this anyway, I'm going to show you how I curl my hair with a hair straightener so I did my hair the way I want and then I clip it up halfway so I have some room to work with the bottom hair so I already did these two and I thought let me show you guys how it's really it. hot this is 450 degrees which actually because I just did my hair I'm turning this down to 420 it doesn't have to be that high so take your hair all right about this much for me I, I'm not gonna get crazy with it you can do smaller ones so you take it you twist it you twist it again I hold this part here and then you pull it through and watch this you just move it. Okay. So I kind of did them already. Uh, let's get another one back here. 
I find that the hair underneath, like this kind of hair, doesn't curl as much. So I'm going to go ahead and probably show you one at the top a little bit better. See? I'll be back when, I, when I'm like done with the bottom. Look at this is the side. See? I look super nuts. But that's what it, that's what it, you kind of look like before you, because my hair, like I said before, my hair is not naturally um, cur uh, straight, it's curly. So, it has that texture to it, boo-boos. But, because my hair is naturally curly, it curls well. So, shit. That's something I didn't mention. I mean, like I said, if you have pin straight hair, I'm not sure how great your hair is going to curl um, if you're going to see it curl like mine because my hair, like I said, is naturally curly, so it, it, it curls quickly. If I put a little water in my hair, it will just curl up. So, I mean, definitely try it out. I believe I got the straightener off of Amazon years ago, but it's my favorite straightener, so I won't give it up. I'll probably just get a new one at some point, but nothing's wrong with it. That little spot there is like the outside's wearing off. But I believe this goes up to 480 degrees, so you want it to be super hot. Um, like right now, I just did my hair, so it's a little, I don't want it to be damaged with that. You know, I already had bleach in it yesterday, so I don't want to go too high with the, the heat. You're really not, you're supposed to let your hair sit for a while after you bleach your hair or dye it anyway, and I'm just going to do this because, you know, I don't listen. <laughs> but. Okay, guys, I'll be back. I'm going to just finish the side. Okay, guys, so I saved the very last piece for you. So let me just get that out of the way. There's two pieces here I'm going to do. Woo, that's hot as a motherfucker. All right, so go ahead and take it from the top. Take your hand. You're going to twist it and pull it down. See how that popped off? Take it from the top, twist it, and pull it down. This one piece down here just refuses to curl. I don't understand what happened here, but I mean, it will mix in with the rest. Oh, there we go. There's like a little, little curl there. Okay. I'll be back. Okay. So this is what it looks like when you curl your hair with a straightener. I let it settle down a little bit. I'll spray it and then kind of like, um, separate them a little bit, but I'll be back for that. Okay guys, so this is my final look. Um, I just put in some little studs that I got from um, BoxyCharm. As you can see, they were only like $7 for them. I think they were on sale. Here's the Juicy Couture perfume. I think this is a knockoff one, but it smells so good and I forgot I had it, so I'm gonna use this today. But I gotta go, I gotta let my dogs out. It's looking like today outside, it's all rainy, crappy. I haven't been in my pool forever. There's Le Lexi, come on. <laughs> Come on. I'm finally home. I just want to show you what I got quickly. I got the carb balance flour tortilla wraps. I got a Caesar salad kit. I believe I got five of the packaged tuna, some pepperoni. Um, I always get Land Lakes yellow cheese, a half a pound of uh, turkey, some eggs, two avocados, two of the Cobb salad. These are probably my favorite. And then 10 of the tuna fish because my cats eat tuna sometimes as well. But Walmart. <laughs> but that's it. Walmart was a quick run. It wasn't like I was going shopping, shopping. So I got a few things and I got a few things I'll show you upstairs as well. Some just shirts. But that's it. Um, I didn't do much filming there because it was fucking insane and I can't stand people. So I was trying to go in and out quickly. I don't know what's going on Friday at three o'clock, but people are insane. So that's it.